Today, guys, I'm making some shrimp rasta pasta, jerk shrimp rasta pasta. I know you've seen it on my channel, and I had like a snippet of the video already done. So right now, I'm going to show you how I make it. You're going to use like a tablespoon of Obey, some Cajun seasoning, lemon pepper, of course, some jerk seasoning. All right. Also, it's nothing but Walker's wood, jerk seasoning. You can either use the mild or the hot, spicy. Today, I'm just going to choose for the mild. This is a tablespoon, right? A tablespoon and a half. I got my water boiling over there for my pasta. And what you can do, you could do this the night before and you could let it marinate. Well, I'm going to do this right now because I'm hungry. I'm going to set this to the side. Chop on my vegetables. And now coming right back. And this right here, I changed pots. So now I have all my vegetables rendering down. And to this, I'm going to add some heavy whipping cream. We're gonna season this up with some jerk seasoning. Not gonna use no obey, no more, because we already have it on the shrimp. Some garlic powder. It's like a tablespoon. It depends on how much noodles you have. Right now, I, I pulled a box of noodles, and I think I don't have enough shrimp to go. You know what we're going to do? We're going to work this out. Also, I'm going to add some more jerk seasoning to this right here. I said, this is more than a dollop, right? And then my pasta. And everything incorporates. If you need to add more pasta, it depends on how much shrimp you have too. If you need to add more pasta, add more pasta. Don't worry, it's gonna render down. Because right now I'm gonna use some mozzarella cheese. some shredded parmesan cheese. It's gonna get thickened. All right. I have this on a medium heat. You need some more mozzarella cheese? Add more mozzarella cheese. It's your dish. You're making it to your liking. All right? I'm gonna 
have some Cajun season. And to this, I'm going to add some more mozzarella cheese. I think I need some more. More is better. cheesy and now I'm gonna add my little shrimp to the cheese and look at this oh we gooey Let this thicken up and I'll be right back. Hi guys, this is the finishing results. And I also fried some fish. If you want to see how I fried the fish, comment down below. And here we got it. We got your shrimp rasa pasta and some fried fish. Footprints ain't got nothing on me.